What is going on everyone? It's TG Smooth and XG Smooth. Welcome back to another episode of Grounded Guys and this is part three of our full walkthrough. I hope you guys have been enjoying the episodes so far. Um, me and Bub would like to take a little time out to thank you guys for all the support you have shown so far. What are you doing up here, Raw Weevil Me? <laughs> and yeah, just uh, just want to say thanks. Uh, just know your viewership's enough for us, but if you want to go that extra step and like and subscribe, share the videos, then that's cool with us as well. We really appreciate it. Mm -hmm. All right, so I believe we left off. We just got out of the oak tree lab and we have some more parts to analyze so i'm gonna go down here we also unlocked the asl terminal in the last episode yes we did so we got a few quests we can do and get raw science for that Ooh, red ant club. yes we finally got our red ant club Let's... that's a free tier three weapon tier three tier three i wish <laughs> <laughs> that tier two tier is it tier two yeah it is tier two okay um, and then we'll analyze acid glands acid and gland? get our bug rubber. Yay, bug rubber, bimpy bumper. Bug rubber. All right, go ahead, gather more supplies on our way yep. back to the base. Um, now, fibers. if we do come yes. over this way, guys, uh, you'll come across the flower area, uh, the flower garden, and sometimes in the mornings you'll be able to come across flower petals. It doesn't look like any have fallen today. What the yep. crap? <laughs> what? Maybe we just park, go park, parkour mode and just parkour up there and just chop them. Because I do know you can chop these. Yeah, we can chop them as well. Okay, here's some over here. Flower petals. But we have to watch it. This is like Orb Weaver's spider territory oh. and can be super dangerous. So we're <laughs> gonna... Uh, there's, there's probably one in here sleeping. Nope. Okay, so we'll go ahead and grab this raw science. I did want to show you guys this. Around these flowers, you will come across nectar. Now, this is going to be used for cooking up meals later on. You show uh, me nectar's in uh, there. Quite a bit. And then oh. I, I believe we can hop up here. Uh huh. And. Super duper right? <laughs> it's like tightrope. It is like tightrope walking. Okay, and fly over there, jump on that, and then we can get to the front of this pedal. I believe usually they have some nectar in it, and you can find nectar up here. Um, if not, can we chop this bad boy down? No. Okay. Not the top, I see. All right, and then there's another landmark, and that's gonna be the Calvo can. <laughs> and we wanna watch out for this little rock line. Um, not only do orb weavers spawn over there, but mosquitoes will be here in, I believe, a day or so. And if I'm correct, there is a collectible in this can. Let's go ahead, yes, and get another scab. And that's going to be our Billy Hog Whore Scabby Scheme. And if you guys didn't know, you can go right in here to the OS and change that. We're going to do that because I don't really care for these colors. And not classic. Uh, LCD. Whoa. I like high contrast the best. Um, until we get... I, there's one that's like Moldork. And I love yep. the color scheme of that one. But as Bub was saying, you can also hop up these plants. You can parkour up them. Um, well, if that don't happen. <laughs> Let's go ahead. And then you can oh. chop the Whoa. flower petals at the top of these. You just kind of go around it Whoa. in a circle. Um, oh. Nothing too hard. And then let's go ahead. Hosta chop plant. the hosta plant and get our flower petals. Now, they can come in a variety of colors, guys, but it's still just the same old flower petal. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, I'm just goofing off. I, I just wanted to grab at least one. Um, so you analyze it? Yes, so we could analyze it later. So we got that. We're going to head back to the base. Um, where are you at, Bubs? 
You're just up here peeping me. Are you peeping me up there? <laughs> yes. Okay. And then we really got to start um, headed towards the hedges and yep. stuff like that. So, Bub, if you want to come down here and eat real fast, mm -hmm. um, while you're doing that, I'm going to run up here and hey, show easy. them where the next little bit of raw science is, right by the base. And we can go ahead, boop, hop fairly easily right up here. Um, at nighttime, a bunch of gnats will come up here, guys. So later on, that's a pretty good spot for taming these little fellas. Oh, you got stuck in the web. And then if you chop the webs, you will get web fiber which is eventually gonna lead to silk rope, which we'll yep. need for crafting later. So let's go ahead, I'm gonna dump my inventory real fast. Bubs, clear out as much of this as possible. Mm -hmm. Boop. Oh my God, dude. I know, I have so much in here. No, but um, when I open the we'll, chest, it's we'll just that. super red and orange. Um, uh, I basically got rid of everything except the food. You did? Yep. Okay, well, I'm going to cook uh, more food. Yeah. Boop, boop. We should probably go to bed before those big, meany spiders get into uh, our base. Well, if we're going away from the base, I don't think we really have to sleep. And I did forget to mention, guys, when you invest in the um, the smithing table, it's also going to give you the blueprints to craft the tier 1 um, armor and weapon stones. So just a heads up on that. I forgot to mention that before. We'll go ahead and put down the smithing station now that we have it. Bam. And we're going to need sap, brittle marble, brittle quartzite shard, and crude rope to build. Most of which we already have besides the marble shard. Uh, let's go ahead and here. Need sap. Grab that, sap, crude rope, and that's about all we have for this bad boy. And I'm sure we'll find a marble shard laying around sooner or later. Yep. And I just want to say a huge thank you for breaking 10 subscribers. Wow, you guys are amazing. Oh yeah, and on Bub's channel, he is up to 13 subscribers for... So I appreciate that guys, like I said in the beginning of the video, we always appreciate all your support and we love it so much. Mm -hmm. Alright, I forgot what I was doing. Alright, now we got everything put up, I am fully fed, I need a little bit of water so um, we'll just get some along the way. We have acorn armor, so we're doing good on armor compared to the clover armor. Yep. Um, so let's go out and farm a little bit, bubs. Mm-hmm. Well, we need some new resources. Oh, yeah. Um, we definitely got to go for the tier 2 crafting stuff. Yep. So I believe along the way to the hedge, we're going to run into um, quite spiders. a bit of larva. Now, we'll avoid the spiders for now, um, and let's go over here. I, I We ran straight by this in the last episode, but this is the Whelp flavor drink. And then, once again, once we get a Tier 2 hammer, there's a tooth back here, but I'll cover all of that, and we'll start worrying about that once we get that Tier 2 hammer. Uh -huh. And then, if you run down here, there is an armed Raspberry Punch-Out, and like I said, uh, we're going to need all these juice boxes in order to get um, a future mutation, which I don't think we've gotten any yet. Yeah. Yeah, no, we have none. We have nothing. We're on like, we're like an hour and something into the game. Yep. <laughs> all right. So also, if we head this way, the opposite way, um, I was showing you guys earlier and you keep following them rocks, it's just... An extension of the flower garden so we're gonna come down here grab these flower petals and then there okay. is another thistle plant you it, could go ahead and grab all the thistle needles from that it's a lot easier to get to and less insects than oh, yeah. the other one. Oh yeah way less insects um, 
Like I said, maybe during the daytime there's orb weavers around here, but they're pretty easily avoided. Um, as long as you don't go super close to them, you won't aggro them. So just keep that in mind. I'm gonna grab a bunch of these, bub, and then and I seven. believe okay. we need to start getting our tier two stuff. So. Yeah. Bombardier beetles, stink bugs, stuff like that. Yep. Um, we're probably are... going to go ahead and craft up um, sprig bows for it and then just use arrows. Yep. Um, if you find like the plants like we just topped up for the thistle needles, they're pretty easy to navigate. You can get high enough to where bugs can't jump up and attack you. So you can utilize them early game and kind of get a high high vantage point on them and just rain heck down on them with the arrows. <laughs> yep, just make it like an arrow storm. So we got more thistles. I'm gonna just head back to the base real fast. Um, before we head over to the hedge, there are probably a couple things I want to do first. Um, and that is grab some free Bombardier Beetle parts. I want to show you guys where those are, as well as some free ant parts. Um, yep. Let's go ahead. I'm going to see what we need to craft our bow. And we're going to need a shovel, of course. Yep, of course. Let's go ahead and where is it? Uh, yeah, There's we definitely lighting. have it. So we need neck fuzz. Oh gosh! <laughs> I like how we both bailed the same way. Yeah, but I'm about to die. Oh no. Uh, I mean, I probably am going to as well because the poison. poison? Oh no, I survived. I survived we too. We survived a wolf spider attack. Holy crap. I've never seen it come up into this little area. It must have like been walking past and just seen us there. But then again, we we probably should sleep at night, but um, luckily we need a gnat fuzz, and guys, guess what? Bang. <laughs> gnats. Gnats. Gnats for days. Oh, the oak tree provideth. Oh, okay, bub. Usually they're not this close, and you kind of got to... You kind of usually need a bow and arrow to shoot these guys because they're floating out here so far Yay. I but I three. guess with the full release they fixed that go ahead Bobs. I I I got three nat fuzz from one holy crap man that's that a, is that's a record we have a lot of food now on the on the bright side yeah uh, but so I'm gonna eat I'm gonna, uh, do you need to eat I might take a piece with me. I'm just gonna throw those on there. Yeah, I definitely need to eat. Okay. Because <laughs> yeah, that I need spider health. hurt a little bit. Yep. Okay. But I can't believe. This but we is... survived. I mean, yeah. that's the important part, right? Yeah. Please rose faster. We we definitely survived. Um, I don't I don't know what I I kind of want to build a wall, but not quite yet. Um, we're gonna head back towards the little cave. We had to go and um. Fight all the little lawn mites, and near there is going to be a bit of an infected area we can run into and get a dead bombardier beetle, and that will give us some bombardier parts to analyze. Mm -hmm. And then I'll go ahead and mark it on our map so we don't get lost. And bam, just head towards the mystery machine. Yeah, I would have taken off the wrong way. Alright, we gotta be super careful, Bub. It's nighttime and. I see an ant chasing oh, the I, I see a wolf spider headed right towards me. Okay. I, I think I dodged him. Alright, that's the one that likes to terrorize all the new players. <laughs> that is the meanest wolf spider in the game. And then once we do activate the oak lab and we head back this way, there is going to be a bit of raw science down here a hundred not too much but it's going to help and then we're going to hit a bit more along the way now the raw science out in the world guys it does not pop out until you do the um oak lab and talk the burgle 
So that's why you want to kind of get that done as soon as possible. You don't want to explore too much without um, activating the main quest. You may miss um, quite a bit of the collectibles and raw science, stuff like that. And you're going to have to revisit those areas again. So we're going to head here and we're back to, I call this like the little lawn mite cave. And then switch to melee, like I said. We're gonna gather all the resources we pop. Are, what? This is not Mario! He jumped on my head like three times. Did you see that? <laughs> Please say you saw that. I didn't. Oh my god! He just pulled a Mario on me, Bubs. <laughs> he Goomba stomped you. He did Goomba stomp me. <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was the coolest lawn mite I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> like, I wish I could befriend him now. Okay, and we're back down here. We're gonna grab that raw science since it popped up. And that's gonna be 500 extra for us. So, I mean, that's that's like our um, two-story building stuff right there. And maybe the cooking station we can now afford. But coming back out here, um, we're gonna go and be careful. Remember the stink bug in this area. And we're gonna kind of skirt the outside of this big rock like I said kill all the lawn mites we can with here we go with the Goomba stomp again what is up with y'all in my freaking head man <laughs> it's not the jump on I know I have some perfect fluffy beautiful hair but it's not the jump on it's not a trampoline <laughs> it's like oh he has a trampoline on his head right something I think this m might be the most easiest way to get my fuss and the most easiest way to get little fuss. Yes, this might, the, the long mites are definitely the easiest way to activate this mutation. Because <laughs> they're so easy to kill when, when they may like. Here, Bubs, um, I'm going to drop you something real fast, okay? What, what is it? What is it called? Heal up, my friend. Wow, you picked that up super fast. <laughs> What? The fiber bandage. I threw a fiber bandage. Did you not grab it? No. Oh. Um, well, come here on flat ground. Maybe it rolled downhill. It looked like you grabbed it. Bam. Yeah. And then you can use that and heal up, buddy. Yeah, let's just eat a bandage real quick. Oh, yeah. Mm. Eat it. Yay. Eat it all. Yummy bandages. Eat it all. All right, so you got to be careful, and we have to get in and out of here. This is the haze area, and it's going to hurt a little bit. Pete, you might not have enough life, but like I said, there's just a dead bombardier beetle right there. Bam. And then if we had enough time, we could kill them infected gnats, or if we had our sprig bell crafted, we could do that. There's another bombardier beetle. He's down here. But we are going to go ahead. Uh, do they not have their own scannable? Nope, I already peeped it. That's oh, good. you already peeped it? Yeah. Well, well, appreciate that. And then we got more lawn mites down here. We're going to go ahead and take care of. We're going to avoid that bombardier beetle, but this is... He's like a big nasty boy. Right, he's a big nasty boy right now, but this aggressive. is going to be our first beetle victim. Because he's just kind of over here by himself. Um, not a lot of dangerous stuff around him. Just the lawn mites. And I actually got these lawn mites to attack him one time. You did? Yes. Sweet. Did they kill him? Or did the bombardier beetle kill them? Uh, uh, the bombardier... Uh, uh, it's getting close, Bob. Run. Uh, uh, you got acid. I did. Time to run. Oh. I Not yet. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. <laughs> I'm out of here, sucker. All right, now we can bounce. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. I like to say skediddle. Skediddle. <laughs> All right, and wait. Uh, just out of curiosity, can I craft a spurred bow from my inventory? Yes, just indeed. Uh, can we? Yes. And arrows as well? Yes. Did I bring the... I got the thistles too. All right, I'm going to grab some yep. plant fiber, bub, and make some crude rope. I have none of the stuff, so we might right? want to make a quick trip back to the base. 
Well, I mean, if, if I get the crude rope, I'm pretty positive I can um, make you a bow as well. So let me go ahead, grab enough plant fiber for crude rope. Because and I don't have any naphos. While we're over here, we, we should just be able to take care of that, that guy. Alright, go ahead, crude rope. Boink. Inventory full. Yay, crude rope. Yay, <laughs> crude rope. I stole you. Oh, you stole my crude rope? <laughs> you turkey. Yeah. Now I just need naphos. All right, so this is a little bit of a slow time for the video, but you know what? Sometimes stuff has to get done. Come here. Come here, Weevil. I just, I just want my mutations. Jeesh. <laughs> and hey. 120 raw science. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hey, Weevil. I'll punch him. Just punch him. <laughs> punch him. Punch him. All right, I'm going to eat these mushrooms, even though we didn't have them analyzed. They're pretty easy to find, so... Um, let's go ahead. Hi. Ant crossing. Spread. Cool. Oh, plant fiber. Plant fiber and more plant fiber. I, I just, I just need more crude rope. Uh, I just need gnat fuzz now. I think I got gnat fuzz only. I have gnat fuzz only. Here, let me just drop you. Rope. Yes, I need that other one. And then, boop. I dropped it. All right, so, yeah. there's your bow yeah. for your rope. Appreciate it. And then go ahead, bam. Then go I, ahead, bam. I do have some thistles. Okay. And from those, and from those mites I killed, we have enough to get some arrows. Here you go, bub. Uh, drop stack. Bam. Holy cow. I know, right? It just like poops 20 of them out. <laughs> <laughs> now my 30 arrows. Woohoo! Alrighty, and back to the Bombardier Beetle area. I'm gonna go ahead and grab more just... plant fiber and stuff. And then. Just make it rain arrows. I have to keep a little flow of fiber bandages going for us. Yeah, me too. Okay. Sweet. I need fiber, plant fiber. And guys, it, it is important, little tip, um, I would just keep fiber bandages on you. Um, usually like in game wise, I will proc them before like any big fight with like say a black widow spider. Bombardier. Well, it's not like a black bombardier. Yeah, but it's still, it's a bombardier. I wonder bombardier. if there is a black bombardier. Oh gosh. Exactly. <laughs> Yeah, I, I reacted just in time. <laughs> Horrible police stop and try to equip a bow and arrow. <laughs> okay. Yes, we I got have this. Mine we got this. So, All right. Step one Stink Bug and Bombardier. All right. Where is Stinky Boy? Stinky. Where's where Stinky are Boy? You? Stinky Boy, where'd you go? Stinky. Where did he go? What the crap? Stinky. He was. He was okay. I see him. That's that's weird. Stinky. That's Bambi. <laughs> that's Barely it. does anything to him. <laughs> yeah, I know because I think he's resistant. Now, these guys, for the most part, if you don't get close to them and you run whenever you see them shoot up in the air, um, <laughs> then it's pretty easy to dodge that. If that little pus shot does hit you, it's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt so bad right now, especially in just acorn armor. But as you can tell, I mean, there's a little bit of strategy. You don't have to hop up and get cover um, every single time. Well, I am just raining arrows on him. Oh yeah, we're doing pretty good. Um, I thought this is going a lot better than when we first played, Bubby. Oh my god, I just like shot through your legs. It looked like. Ugh. He's juking us. I know. So bad. Hey, he's hitting the dandy. Ryan. I'm just making it. I'm going to oh, do it. Ow, ow, that hurt. Did we stun him? No, we did not. But <gasps> he is dead. <laughs> okay. He is dead. Sweet. I killed him. I killed him. We, I... we killed him. Hey, hey, don't discredit me. I had 
I had my hands in this fight too. Well, we killed him. Yes, we did. But I, we did a good job. I, but I did the final blow. I, I do have the bombardier beetle parts. Okay, so we got the boiling gland now. Yay. I believe that... Um, I forget what the boiling gland gives us. Uh, I think it's used for the tier 2 hammer, I think. I think you're absolutely right. Okay, I got my 30 arrows back. I got 28. Okay. Good enough for me though. Um, do you want to? We should probably grab the rest of these thistles while we're over here, Bob. Yeah, especially because there isn't no stink bug. Right. We got to be careful of that stink bug. Still, I forgot about Stinky Boy. His name is Stinky. Yes. <laughs> uh, what stinky. is that? Stinky. Okay. More like Stingy. There's the bees. I'm just gonna go. Whoa, I am like Parkour Jones over here. Parkour Jones. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and we're making good progress so far though. It's like our third in-game day, I believe. Day two or day three. I know there's a little bit of time that... Whoa. <laughs> Boing. 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 Careful, do not fall. I know, but... We're so close. Hey, hey, hey. All right. I, I grabbed like 30. I'm, I'm pretty content with that I amount. Gra I grabbed 31. Oh, hey, look, look what I found on the ground. Okay, so if hey, you guys... Hey, pollen. I know, right? Um, I have room for it. You do? Okay. You want to grab it? Yep, and we'll, pollen. I don't... I, I need water. We, we got to analyze that, right? And yeah. then it should give us Shinobi Sneeze, which mm -hmm. is used to kind of be invisible and juke wolf spiders like I did earlier without the shinobi sneeze. <laughs> um, yeah, but Bump, we're making great progress. Yep. Hey, 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 don't run from me now. And if you guys didn't know, if you shoot the red ants in the eyeballs, it is their weak spots. Uh, hey, it hurts them. Uh, later on, once we do get better equipment, you can shoot them in the eye and like one shot them. Um, Fairly easy. Same with the soldier ants, and that I believe applies to all the ants in the game. If you hit them in their eyeball, it's just a weak spot. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna eat this. Uh, that way I can switch weapons and stuff. Oh, oh, punch a mushroom. And like I said, back to our trying to get little fists as our mutation, and then. Hey, hey, ant. Hi, how you doing? Okay, I, I want to tame ants so in this. I know, that would be so cool if we stuff. could ride around on ants and stuff. But we're going to head back to the base now. Uh, we pretty much came and got what we needed. Uh, once we analyze these parts, it's going to open up some of the tier 2 stuff for us, which is going to be where the game really starts at. Because, you know, we don't stay in tier 1 too long, do we? Yep, yep. I'll bring it on, Weevil. Come on, I, Weevil. I only need to kill like 40 of you with my fist. I, I have a little I can't fist. believe oh. he just juked me <laughs> through a mushroom. What the crap? Okay, we're killing a lot of time. I'm headed back to the base, Bubby. Yep. Holy <laughs> crap. I'm, I'm just getting... I get so sidetracked, guys. I just can't help it. I love this game. Um, it's just... It's just so nostalgic from being a kid and watching Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. And they were just, it was a great movie back in the day. I mean, and if you love that movie, how could you not love this game? All right, we're getting it. Oh, gosh. Into uh, the wrong kind of territory here. Yep. We strayed off a little bit, Bubs. Yep. Uh, let's look up here. Okay. Yep. Um, <laughs> yeah, we'll just go that way. And I think then... there's another juice box we yeah, we're in that area. Yeah, there's like but a whole bunch of new insects about. I'm, I'm, hey, look, I'm getting low on water, so start <laughs> looking for water bubs. I, I'm already at full water. What? How? Mm. If it fight, if it uh fight. Oh. What do you, do? you you drank the aphid sweeties? Yeah. You know how did that taste? Yummy. Yummy. <laughs> And I think it, the inspired honeydew does more water than food. What? 
more water than food. Yep, so it's like a great source of water. Great source of water. All right. And we'll, we'll keep that in mind. All right, and then we're going to go ahead and analyze the yep. Bombardier Beetle parts, and we get the Jerky Rack, which and is great, and the Insect Axe. And the stuff Bombardier. We get a level up, and that's going to unlock the Grub Armor? Yes, the Grub Armor, and that's just another Tier 1 armor set that's going to give us more stamina. Let's go ahead analyze the boiling glint and get the insect hammer so that's going to be the beginning of our tier 2 craft or er, harvesting tools yeah harvesting tools and then let's go ahead and do the nap fuzz for no reason we could have got something better from the flower petal but oh bubby 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 yeah i'm gonna stay inside uh okay that's cool i'll get rid of him Oh, he's he's already off of me. It's this acorn armor, man. We just draw so much attention. Everything wants to eat our juicy acorn parts, bubs. Um, you're gonna have a hard time because he. Oh, well, no, never mind. I I plead the fifth on that one. <laughs> I thought he was gonna be in the way between you and the base, but you managed. Good job, bubs. Yep, I'm like a manager. You're like a manager. You crack me up, man. Alright, let's go ahead throw this in here. Uh -huh. And more thistle needles. And we're gonna put all this other stuff in this chest. And wham bam, we got a little stash going, bub. Look at all this. I know. It's and then so once our meat spoils, that's gonna give us spoiled meat. I believe if we analyze that, we can get spoiled meat slurries. And that is, I believe, how we get nuts. the gnats, yes. So just keep that in mind. And then I'm gonna go ahead and cook us up some food, bubs. Cool. We need food. Food is our life. Food is life. Yes. All right, and we also have our shovel, and since we have our shovel, uh, let's go ahead and equip that. There should be some grubs um, that are usually down here. Yeah. Yes. So right Where's here, you'll just see them digging through the ground. I'm gonna go ahead and switch to melee. Any easy kills, pretty much, I'm just gonna be meleeing, guys. And that's gonna give us our grub hide it should give us grub sludge as well. Yes, there we go. So plenty to in analyze. We don't even have the like analyzing capabilities right now. The analyzer can't keep up with us, bubs. <laughs> All right, is there any more around here? We definitely need more grubs. And this is once again, something else you guys are gonna want to farm because this can help you get your tier one uh, weapon and, well, no, it's the tier one armor upgrades for the grub hide. And I can show you that real fast. Go ahead and craft in here the brittle plating. Oh, um, no, that did not. Okay, so I, I guess eventually we'll get the recipe that's gonna allow us to use the grub hide and the larva spikes to craft the tier one stuff. I thought that came with the science. Hmm. I, I was wrong on that though. So we do have to find it, Bubby. We have to find a piece of marble. It's not gonna be fun. All right, go ahead and get that. Got some raw grub meat going on. Uh, any more around here? Any sometimes, more grubby boys? Sometimes I just forget what I'm doing. It, it's very easy to do that and Okay, it's grub harvesting time. Very understandable. I think I got all the grub by the base. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw this stuff in there. Well, I'm scanning the area for more. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cause oh my god, we got so much stuff. <laughs> overflow. Overflow, inventory overflow. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's yeah. the way we like it though, right? Yep. A lot of resources, a lot of things to okay, do. Okay, maybe if I analyze the grub hide, I don't know. It it would typically give you the grub armor. 
the, I, I kind of want the spider out of the way, man. He's going to take up so much time just waiting for him to do his little path. What do you think, bub? I, I think we got enough arrows to rain it down on this guy and make um, it happen. Just hold on because I'm nowhere near there. Oh, okay. I scanned the area for grubs, and there is no grubs. Oh, well, I mean, it's it's all good. Uh, re regardless, um, I can tick this guy off, and as you guys just seen, he'll shoot webs at me. If I go ahead and harvest this, sometimes it will give you web sacks. Or not. I thought... Web, or web fiber. Web fiber, yeah. I, I thought it gave you web fiber. What the crap? Yeah, Lord be... Weaver, you're making me look bad over here. I see him. I know, right? He's so scary. I'm like a sniper on his perch. But I, I, I kind of want him out of here. Get out of here, stupid. Get out of here. <laughs> hey, I'm walking here. How do I actually... He takes so little damage from this tier one bow. Where are you at, you goofball? Like... Now he's attacking the ant. Oh gosh. Yeah, perfect. At least they don't poison. Yeah, very true. Oh, you're up there raining it down on him? Good, 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 good. All right, we got this, Bubby. Yes. Oji. Stop hiding. Right. You little goof. What? Come out. So I can snipe you in the butt. I am so used to playing in first person when I'm shooting the bow and arrow. <laughs> it's hey, like, he's a, hey, but he's aggroed on me now, so I guess that's a, uh, come on. Stop hiding. Good job. Well, I mean. Stop being a little filthy cheater is here. It's, it's cool because the more he does this, to be honest, the more web fiber we'll have, hopefully. I, will you stand still? Stand still so I can shoot you in the webs. Oh my goodness. I Why? actually, I, I hit him in the webs. He doesn't like being shot in the webs. I, I don't know why his webs are just like going through me. It's just like, eh, eh. Nah. Watch, 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 watch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but it's crazy. It is. He just oh my... keeps dodging my arrows. It's crazy. I'm, I'm getting him pretty good. I'm, I'm out of arrows. Don't you wish you could jump up here and get me? Oh, crap. I am too. Um, here's the plan, bubs. I'm gonna throw up some blocks, right? You come up and whack him behind. When he starts chasing you, just start blocking, and I'll come up behind him, and yeah, we'll do this. Alright? And try to get some arrows. Whee! Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. If I can get out of here, this is crazy! He's at... Ooh, get perfect blocked! Oh, you parried him? Sweet. I'm coming up. I Try got your back. I per perfect blocked him. Nice. Stop him. Yeah, we got him. Yeah! yeah. Victory! Victory is ours. You want to harvest him? You yes, want to dig him out? Yeah, spider chunks. Ooh, now our entire place is infested with webs. Yeah, and I, I thought this would give us web fiber. What the it crap? does. I think. I, I thought it did too. Because we used to we used to farm web fiber this way. Mm -hmm. Um oh unless God. they change that with the patch or something. What the crap? Why can't I not even there we go. I'm in third person now. Yeah, I'm not I'm not getting web fiber from these anymore. I'm not either. Oh, so they changed that. They changed that big time. I, no, I, I don't think... It, ladybugs are a different story. They're a little bit... They got a little bit more HP. And they... I, I don't know. Do you think we could take it, Bubs? Uh, hold on. Get... <laughs> He's just looking at me like, ride this. I mean, because eventually we do have to get in the ladybug armor. Yep. Um... I don't... we just I ride don't... him to victory? We could ride him to victory, Bubs. Let's... Take us to victory, ladybug! Victory is this way. See, he already knows. He's just gonna go right up into the base, cause and then he, we'll he knows him. where all the winners lose. 
Yeah, yeah, exactly. He's just going to our base. Look, he's gonna become our friend. Oh no, we just crap. <laughs> is he's it like too dirty up here? Are you saying our house isn't clean enough for you, Ladybug? I mean, that's pretty offensive, bro. I'm not gonna lie. You know what? <laughs> Risk it for the biscuit? Risk it for the biscuit. I'm just, uh, okay, you do that. I'm gonna rain arrows down on them. Oh gosh, I do nothing to him. I do nothing. I imagine my arrows are going Don't to do jump. it, Ladybug, please, I'm sorry. No, we can't mess with this guy. He's too straight. Yeah, no, 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 no. He, he's, uh, he's a little tanky right now. He's a little tanker. He's a little tanker. Maybe if I had a ready ant club? Um, yeah, that would make it We were supposed to be headed towards the hedge lap, though. So, yeah. um, let's go ahead and head I over think, there, Bubs. I think we need some red ant clubs before we go beef into spider country. Um, I'm going to see, what do we need for the tier 2 axe, still or hammer? Berry leather, we can get that. Stink bug parts. We need, oh, we need that ladybug head so bad. And then we and have to craft. Um, do we well, have the I, spinning wheel? Yes, we gotta craft our spinning wheel. So we can get oh, our silk rope. My gosh, that's gonna take a lot. So we still need to dig up clay as well, Bubs. Mm, that's, <laughs> a lot. that's a lot of resources. Yes, it is. Well, I don't we think we're completely ready for the hedge lab yet. Is well, why I'm hesitating to go over there. Uh, I I have enough resources to get it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because I have five crude rope and two acorn tops. Heck yeah. So now we just need ant parts. Ant parts and. Um, I believe we also need. Don't put my pebble hammer in there. It's silly. Ish. And then right down here uh -huh. is the lemon crime puncho. Heck yeah, so I believe that's like four juice boxes now, and we need like five? Yeah. Something like that. Six, seven, maybe Five, seven. six, seven, eight, twenty. <laughs> <laughs> you did your math wrong. <laughs> totally wrong. All right, and then Bubby, I'm going to head towards the hedges. I think we'll go over there. We won't go through the lab. I don't believe we're going to have enough time on this episode. Um, but we will go ahead and get the berries and the berry leather. If we manage to make it that far. Let's go ahead. I know there's some bombardier beetles in this area. We'll go add some, some fresh water. And there should be a crap ton of larvas. Let's go ahead. We're not going to punch these guys. And, um, I don't know if I can take all these by myself. This is something, this area, I would definitely need you for, kiddo. Mm -hmm. But this might be some free clay I can dig up while they're sleeping. Yeah, so this little area, um... We're right by the hedges. The hedges are right over there. You can see them. Uh, the hedge entrance. Oh gosh. All right. All right. Ooh, ooh. You can't be no worse than a spider. Yeah. Get wrecked. Yay, what are the spikes? And there's our larva spikes. But that's what I was telling you for the tier one weapon stones. Eventually, we'll get a recipe that will let us use those larva spikes to craft those. So you're going to want to farm those um, and keep a lot of them. And I mean a lot of them. Okay, you want a piece of me? Want a piece of me? And block. Oh, oh, oh. It didn't block it very Yeah, the good. grass kind of blocked my view. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we just need clay and red ant parts. All right. And maybe... Nope, sap. Okay, I need some sap. I already got the sap. Well, if you head this way, I could definitely use it to make some fiber bandages. Oh, 
And then we're gonna dig up this clay that should allow us enough to craft our spinning wheel. And there is some clay way back towards the mystery machine that's a lot more early game than this um, that you guys can go ahead and grab. But once you start hitting like this puddle area, uh, you're gonna start running into mosquitoes, fireflies, and, and, and stuff fleas. like that, water fleas. The water fleas aren't too bad and it is a pretty good source of food. Um, I know you're gonna have to kill a crap ton of them in order to gold card them, which we'll be going over um, throughout this guide. Not quite yet. Water flea. Yep. <laughs> Get blocked. And done. I didn't know you blocked water Oh fleas. gosh, I threw my spear. Why, why, why did I do that? Okay, now we gotta go find the spear. <laughs> And we got our water fleet. Well, at least the spear floats. Let's test it. Let's confirm. Spear floats, bub. Okay. <laughs> I'm then... getting bombarded by lawn mites and larva. Lawn okay. mites and larva. Here, I will... I'll turn I'm around. Coming. I'm coming. Right, right. I'll wait on you a little bit. I'm coming. Because as soon as you get in the water, you should be safe. Yeah, I'm safe now. I'm okay. In the water. <clears throat> We need a dagger to chop stuff in water. Yes, have, we do. I have no idea what which dagger we need, but I, I feel like we need two, one and two, or two daggers to chop stuff in water. Mm-hmm. You're absolutely right. At first, we just need the tier one dagger. Um, and sorry. like everything, you just gotta work your way up in this game to the tier twos, bub. Yep. But we're not going to get too far ahead of ourselves because we are now encroaching the hedge area. The hedge has spiders and, and spider this countries. is going to be pretty much um, the, the bulk of the tier 2 um, bugs over here. You're going to have like the mosquitoes, the fireflies, the and orb the, weavers. And some tier 1 bugs like the gnat. Yeah, and you'll have gnats, you'll have mosquitoes. I believe in the most recent patch that mosquitoes don't start spawning until the second day, but we're going to come across our next landmark as well, and that's going to be the Labice can, I yep. believe. Alright, and then we're just going to keep swimming on over here until we hit like this little garden spade. I see a white thing up there. You see a white thing? Yeah, that's the lab. And then we got no, our bow and arrow. Right there. Oh. And then we have our bow and arrow, which we specifically want to craft before we come over here. Um, and that way we can just shoot these berries down. And then wham, bam, we can go ahead and harvest them up. We're going to grab a few of these. I do kind of want to make my hammer um, and the tier 2 axe before I really start getting into the other labs. And that's just because, like I said, we're going to come across these milk molars and collectible stuff that we're going to need to harvest anyway. So we definitely want that tier 2 hammer. Alright, and Bub is just being an awesome child right now and shooting down all the berries in the world for me and then if we come over here guys this is going to be the entrance into the hedge yep and this is going to take you up to the hedge lab we're not going to quite do that this episode but we are going to hit up this field station because yep. i know we have plenty to analyze and there's a granola bar right here a granola bar and then hold off on that bubs and then we're going to go ahead analyze the berry leather and get or our berry get the berry leather which is going to allow us to craft that axe and hammer that we need um, we're gonna go ahead and do the larva spikes. I believe that's gonna be our tier one dagger. Some more potions and just some more cosmetic stuff. Um, 
I think I, I have so many animals real quick. Okay. And Bub is going to go ahead. Analyze the web fiber. And analyze the web fiber for our silk rope and basketball hoop. Oh yeah, we can play some hoops now, Bubs. Yeah. And then as we go up into this field station, guys, there is going to be a lore piece that's going to be Kaju Children. There's another bar right here. Nom, 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 nom. Ooh, that healed me too. Nice. Yeah, bars are good. They're plenty of floating, which means you get healed a lot. Awesome. And then... Floating is your health. We have our berry leather, so I'm um, er, our berry chunks. Um, yeah, berry chunks. But we're gonna need quite a bit more, so might as well go ahead. Oh, uh, that's okay. Well, that's weird. And third, third, really? Okay, now that I can see through my own big head, Roger that. <laughs> Let's go ahead and gather this. Yep. And then this is going to be quite a long episode, guys. It's just prepping from like that beginner area kind of to a more intermediate area. And under the hedge, it isn't so bad towards the entrance, but as we move um, more this way, and I'll go ahead and bring up the map. As we move more this way and then up that way, um, there's going to be a lot of orb weavers, orb weaver juniors. Yep, and we are not ready. And stuff like that. And you can see how much we struggled with that one spider earlier. So you can imagine what we're about to face up in here. And then there are going to be these little spiderlings. They're not so bad, um, but they do become quite a nuisance, I would say. They they don't do that much damage, but they do uh, a decent amount. Yep, yep. All right, and uh, it's it's kind of dark and hard to see, but somewhere when you go more towards the, I, I call this, I don't know what to call this, uh, the sprinkler area, then the you path? should become, come across a path that lets you cut up into the hedge area. Um, There's a smashed lab over here. Yes, right here. And then we're going to come here, kind of sneak past that orb weaver. But if you guys bust open these web sacks, you'll find that they're... Oh, gosh. I'm out of stamina. All right, bub, prepare your spear. I have my spear. All right, we're going to get That's ready. That's orb weaver junior. What? Yeah. Yeah, we can take the junior. We can definitely take the junior. Yeah, he, he has the same amount of health, but he also does poison. Oh, poison. they do do poison now. I forgot about that. I need to heal, so we're gonna eat my necklace. I mean, I think he's taking more freaking damage than the orb weaver. Oh jeez, that's a big boy. Oh yeah, and we got a big boy headed towards us. Okay, we'll just back off a little bit. Two big boys. Alright, and these Orb Weaver Juniors, if you guys have your bow and you just keep working your way backwards, um, that's kind of the strat for them. Yeah. Alright, you left me alone, what the crap? Okay, I have my spear. I'm gonna go in with the melee. Walk, walk. Oh, he poisoned me. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Alright, oh no, oh no. All right, I can revive you, so no biggie. And then. I got a fight, honey, dude, gives you. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Get out of peep. No, 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 no. I need stamina. Run, Johnny, run. We're not ready for all that. Maybe this little spider one, but that's about it. Oh gosh, and he still hurts a little bit. So this is kind of why we want upgraded stuff from here, guys. Yeah, um, ladybug stuff is definitely the way to go. They they start hurting a little bit. All yeah. right, we're gonna craft that up. And woo! I got a bandage. I got a bandage. I, I got a bandage. Hey 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 hey. 
Um, I don't, I'm at half health. I, I think we can shoot this guy. Yeah, let's let's do that, Bubs. Yeah, but he's so hard to shoot because he's so small. <laughs> yeah, do yeah, just, just stay question? down there. Do I have any question why he's just sitting there and posing for me? I, I, no. Maybe, maybe he wants to be... He was like, oh, he jumped. What the crap? I don't even know where he went. He, he, <laughs> where, he's where he's where in he, the moss. Where'd he go? What the crap? What are you doing down there, silly? I can't... Oh, gosh. I'm in the moss, too. Woo, woo, woo. I'm, I'm shooting him. Okay, like have two arrows. Squats. Yeah, yeah, got him. Hey, my arrows. Hey, well, what's my arrows? some of them. Okay. Um, so moving on. <laughs> um, got a little distracted there, but yeah, you can bust open them web sacks. We might check them out here in a second, but uh, they can contain some tier two stuff in it, so just keep that in like mind. Like stink bug parts? Yes, like stink bug parts or bombardier beetle parts. Um, oh, tier no, two. we gotta have our tier two axe. Dang it. I was gonna, and yeah. So if you come over past the little, um, what, 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 bird nest feeder? Bird feeder? Yeah, bird feeder. No, it's bird bath. Bird bath, bird feeder, whatever. Um, <laughs> Bub over here making making me seem silly. Push this ashore. Yeah, there's usually um, crow feathers you can get pretty early game. Um, I think the ones in the water, if you bust them up, they only give you like one uh, crow feather piece, but that's gonna help you get your tier two crossbow when you analyze that crow feather, but you have to have the tier two X. So, and you also need it for another thing, the tier 3x. Mm hmm. Wait, you need them for the tier 3x? Yeah. What? All right, so that's pretty much going to wrap up this video, guys. Uh, we're going to head back to the base, start getting prepped to get more tier 2 stuff, maybe yep. find some stones to upgrade our weapons and armor and stuff like that before we come over here to the hedge. Um, maybe try to take on a ladybug and get the ladybug armor. That helps especially um, all the way into endgame. So just keep that in mind. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, part three of the guide, the full walkthrough. If you do, uh, please, please subscribe to the channel and show all your support. Smash that like button, share all that extra special stuff. But besides that, everyone, it's been nice hanging out, and I hope you guys have a beautiful day. And remember, to stay smooth. smooth. All right, peace. Oh, well, there's Rash. So we have the Rash um, location in this area, just so you guys don't miss that. And then we got to head back up north. I don't know why I was following you, kiddo. Um, <laughs> and head back up north and go to the oak tree. I'm on my way there.